Have you ever wondered who discovered the first Diplodocus fossil and what impact it had on our understanding of dinosaurs? Let's go back in time to the year 1877. An unusual fossil was unearthed by Samuel W. Williston and Benjamin F. Mudge in the rugged terrains of Colorado. At first they were baffled by the enormous size of the fossil, which was unlike anything they had encountered before. The sheer length of the fossil hinted at an ancient giant, a creature that dwarfed all known species. Fast forward a year to 1878 when renowned paleontologist Othniel Charles Marsh took a look at this puzzling specimen. Marsh, with his keen eye and vast knowledge, identified the fossil as a new dinosaur species, which he named Diplodocus, meaning double beam, in reference to its unique tail structure. This groundbreaking discovery not only unveiled a new dinosaur species, but also set the stage for a revolution in our understanding of prehistoric life. So, how did the discovery of Diplodocus change the field of paleontology? Quite significantly, as it turns out, this colossal dinosaur with its long neck and tail presented a new paradigm in our understanding of dinosaur anatomy and behavior. Its structure suggested a radically different mode of living compared to that of other dinosaurs known at the time. The Diplodocus's long neck, for example, led scientists to theorize that these dinosaurs likely fed on the leaves of tall trees, changing prior assumptions about dinosaur diets. Its lengthy tail as well, sparked ideas about possible uses in defense or communication, hinting at complex social behaviors. Moreover, the sheer size of the Diplodocus made scientists rethink dinosaur locomotion, leading to new theories about how these giants moved. The Diplodocus, in all its grandeur, challenged our assumptions and expanded our knowledge about the incredible diversity and complexity of dinosaur life. But the Diplodocus didn't just leave an impact on science. Have you noticed how it's also embedded in our pop culture? From the silver screen to the pages of children's books, the Diplodocus has been a constant presence. In films, it's often the gentle giant we come to love, like in the iconic Jurassic Park, where it's a serene contrast to the more ferocious dinosaurs. And who could forget the heartwarming tale of Littlefoot, the young Diplodocus protagonist in The Land Before Time? It doesn't stop at movies and books. The Diplodocus has been immortalized as toys, puzzles, and even as inflatable pool floats. Its long neck and tail, distinctive shape and friendly demeanor have made it a favorite among children worldwide, sparking curiosity and fascination for the prehistoric world. The Diplodocus has truly become a symbol of the dinosaur era, captivating the imaginations of children and adults alike. From Jurassic Park to the land before time, the Diplodocus has roared its way into our hearts, becoming a beloved part of our cultural landscape. So, what is the Diplodocus's legacy? As we've journeyed through the history of this colossal creature, we've seen its profound impact on both science and popular culture. The Diplodocus has been a catalyst for numerous scientific discoveries, unveiling secrets of the dinosaur era, and advancing our understanding of these magnificent beasts. Its towering stature and distinct features have inspired countless representations in books, movies, and even toys, engraving its image into our collective consciousness. The Diplodocus has transcended time to become a symbol of curiosity and fascination. Its legacy is not merely confined to the dusty pages of history books or the hallowed halls of museums. It lives on in the minds of children marveling at dinosaur toys, in the awe of spectators at natural history exhibits, and in the thrill of moviegoers watching prehistoric giants come alive on the silver screen. In science and in imagination, the Diplodocus stands tall, a testament to the wonders of our prehistoric past and a symbol of our enduring fascination with the world of dinosaurs.